All right. I'm on B. You got sound? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Wait, do it again. Yeah. All right, Chris, you are glowing today. You look hot. Yeah, man. Is this on? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 2006 Jayco Select 12 HW. So this is a pop-up we just got in. It's a nice big pop-up. It's a high wall. It's got a slide out. And it's actually uh, very well equipped. It's got an air conditioner. It's got an awning, a refrigerator, two LP tanks. So we'll just walk around this, kind of show you what type of shape it's in. Overall, I've looked around this. The canvas looks really good. I don't know if it was ever replaced or whatnot, but it's uh, just very clean. Looks really good. Um, just uh, really good condition. Sidewalls all look good. There's not too much fading. Um, you have a nice little grab handle. Jayco does a cool thing where they put the crank of the awning um, and then the crank down for your stabilizer jacks in the door, which is kind of a neat little invention uh, that I haven't seen other people do. Um, one thing I noticed, um, it looks like the tires got kind of a funky wear on it where it's worn on both sides. So I don't know if it was just towed with uh, low tire pressure or what the deal is, but something to be aware of. And they're original tires too, so they're, they're getting up there in age. Um, over here you will have a grill for the outside and then your quick connects down here. Um, but you do have four stabilizer jacks, so it should be nice and secure at the campsite. And it's, uh, you know, there's not, it's not showing much rust at all either, so that's a good thing. Um, like I said, canvas all looks really good. And then Jayco does the system basically where there's Velcro around here, so you're not pulling any straps across. So it should be relatively easy to set up. Um, and then your crank for your lift systems down there on the back wall of the trailer. But you have rock guard in the back, rock guard in the front, spare tire on here. Um, got a 30 amp power cord. This is the back of your refrigerator. Um, here's your slide out and you got a little bit of extra storage down here. It's a nice big, just nice big roomy pop-up and uh, a lot of sleeping. So I believe it's um, probably six to seven people in here. Outside shower and you do have a water heater on here. Um, obviously we have the bed out, but you do have a nice storage compartment over here. And then up front, you will have two 20 pound LP tanks. So those are nice and easy to exchange. And you do have a battery on board as well. All right, so we can check out the inside. All right, so up front, trailer looks real good. You got a little bench here. This is a flip up table. So you can hang out and eat here. Um, I believe this is a queen size bed. Mattress looks good. I mean, a little bit dirty inside here, but nothing really out of the ordinary. All right. Big dinette on this side for the slide out. So this is an indoor outdoor table, nice and easy to remove. And then this will also drop down and lay flat and you can use these existing cushions basically to go over the table, then to convert that into a two person uh, bed. And then another nice thing is that you do have um, big deep uh, storage that actually passes through on that side of the dinette. And then you have a little pull out cabinet there. Here's your refrigerator. So that can work on electric or um, LP gas and you have a little freezer on top. On this other side, you have a nice little cooking spot, two burner cooktop, even a double sink, not a, not a single bowl sink. Uh, your furnace control, just a little bit more storage. So this is, so here's actually your weight sticker from Jayco. So basically what you want to look for is unloaded vehicle weight, 26.95. So this is on kind of the heavier end of pop-ups, um, but you can carry about a thousand pounds of stuff in here if you need to. Um, over here, this mattress looks good. I did notice that there's a little bit of uh, stain basically right here and then down there, but uh, I lifted up both of these mattresses and the baseboards underneath look dry, don't show any uh, signs of water intrusion or anything like that. So this should be a nice, reliable, good family pop-up. 
Uh, again, it's a 2006 Jayco Select. It's a 12 high wall. So um, give me a call. I'm Chris, 815-985-1691. Otherwise, you can call us um, at I-94, 847-395-9500. All right, thanks for watching.